I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Hey Broncos, Life Touch Photos will be on campus on Thursday, February 1st in the Science Building. They will be taking spring portraits for the students that have paid for them already or have money in hand on Thursday. They will also be taking cap and gown photos for graduating seniors that have not had them taken yet. Students that need their photo taken will be sent to the photographers from their science classes. Attention all seniors, if you have already received a college or university acceptance letter for fall 2018, please take them to Ms. Fuentes or Ms. Moreno. You will receive a lanyard when you turn in your letter, and the letters will be displayed in the hallway. OHS Powerlifting will be ordering red Nike dry fit short sleeve shirts. They are $20 each, and they are taking cash only. Please fill out this form and submit it to Coach Garza, including your name, money, and shirt size, by Tuesday, January 30th. We are only ordering on this day. Attention sophomores and juniors, educational planning has started for next year. Have you ever considered joining a CTE program? Please watch the following short video to see if this is something you might be interested in. My dad is a safety manager and he involves himself in the safety field, so it, it really intrigued me when he always came home and told me all these stories about what happens on the field and what he does. Uh, the thing that I've enjoyed the most is getting close to my professors. I've had a great connection and they've helped me plan my college career for the next five years, so that's the thing I love about it. I've always wanted to go to space, so I think it's going to benefit me by going to NASA and per pursuing an aeronautical degree. I got involved with the OSEP program, not really because it was involved in my family, but because it wasn't involved, because my parents worked in the oil field, and I realized all the stories they told me of people getting hurt and how they previously got hurt, so I wanted to find a way to help prevent that. What I like most about the program is basically that it doesn't just apply to the classroom or just at work, because it applies to everyday life and everything you do. I don't really know what I want to do for the future, but I really know that I can do whatever I want with OSEP. Here in the Permian Basin, um, our students that go through either the dual credit program or the OC Tex program are going to be afforded the opportunity to step into an entry level safety technician, field safety position very easily. So it opens door not only in the oil and gas field but in any field. Um, they could also go into policy writing. They could work for any city state um, agency and help out with either developing or amending any safety policy portion and move up the ladder from there. We can provide you with a basis for working safely across all industries. You, you want to save the world. And this is the only way to do it. You can't save the world alone. Yeah, we gotta have safety too. Yeah. <laughs> Our JV Red team also made the trip to San Angelo and competed against the varsity teams of Lakeview and Brownwood. On their first match, they were defeated by Brownwood 9-1, then lost a close one to Lakeview 6-4. Congratulations, OHS tennis. Happy birthday to the following students. You share this day with the following celebrity. That's it for today's Bronco News. Tune in tomorrow for more announcements.